Hi everyone, Zach here, and welcome to my new series on learning C++ by making games. Thank you to Nemian Games for supporting my channel so that I can make this new series. In this series, we'll explore basic C++ concepts by making text and ASCII-based games, such as Number Guesser, Hangman, A Space Invaders Clone, and others. This series will replace the current series, as this series will explore learning C++ in relation to, well, making games. Outside of C++, we'll also explore various concepts that are integral to learning to program, such as pseudocoding and iterative coding. Pseudocoding requires a person to begin to think about how their program is going to work and what it will look like. This requires you, the programmer, to break the code down to the most basic parts and write out how the code will work in a clear way. Think of it as outlining. And iterative coding is returning to code to improve it. For example, if we took the code from my tutorial on how to make Hangman, we could improve the code by changing some of its structure and thus explore other concepts of C++. You do not need a background in coding of any sort to do this series. Some of the videos in this series will be rather short, but the videos will be released in groupings based on topics. So I'll have a video that explains what a variable is, and then a video on how to declare and initialize a variable. These videos will be released at the same time. This is so that those with some background in other computer languages can skip the explanation videos and get straight into the C++ videos. And for those of you who want to revise or clarify aspects of what you have learned from the series, you can more easily find the videos you need. That said, thank you for checking this new series out, and thank you to my supporters on Patreon. If you want to help this channel grow, please, please hit that like button. It really does help. Also, hit the subscribe and notify icon so you know when the next video is out. Also, consider becoming a supporter on Patreon. That said, I look forward to seeing you in the next lesson, and I hope that you have a wonderful day!